This is how you make a fire motion cover using the Motion Leap app for your next single. So first we click on 3D Motion. We don't have many options, but we do have some good options. And if you're paying for a subscription, that definitely helps. You have more access. And so we're gonna click on this cache one. We can slide the bar up or down to change how it looks. We can also double click on it and we can change how it moves. You can slide the bar up or down to change how fast it moves, the intensity, or how slow it moves. And we're going to go to this one. This is the one I like, so we're going to keep it there. So we're going to go back out to the main frame here. We're going to click on effects this time. So we've got dispersion, smoke, and sparkle. I'm going to go back to dispersion because I found something earlier that I liked there. And this is the one, the money sign, we're going to slide it up a little bit to my liking, and this is the one. So, and we can change the speed of it. It's going a little bit too fast now, so we're going to go back a little bit, dial it back, and that's it. So we're going to click on elements this time, and we're going to scroll down, because I found something I liked. I overshot, so we're going to scroll back up, click on one of these colored bokehs. And we're going to expand this and have it take up a good portion of the space. And I hope you can take some of these steps and make some fire cover art, like I said. But uh, by following these steps, I also created this masterpiece. Yo, Doc, turn me up a bit. Sometimes I don't know who's on my side, but I know. I don't know.